Doctors say that sleep is an important part of your health, but not everyone is getting the proper amount of rest. Sometimes it's because they don't have a bed to sleep on. CBS News Philadelphia reporter Madeline Wright shows us how one nonprofit is trying to help children who need a place to rest. 16 year old Zykea Massey will soon welcome her firstborn. My old bed had broke because as my pregnancy went on, I got a little too heavy for the uh, bed and the springs ended up coming up. She says she got sticker shock when she looked up the price of a new bed. It was like price ranging from 200 to 300 itself and I was like, that is too much money. Her lactation specialist referred her to One House at a Time, a Bucks County nonprofit that runs a program called Beds for Kids. It provides free mattresses, frames, pillows, and bedding for children in need. A lot of the families that we serve have experienced bed bug infestation and have had to dispose of the beds that they had in the home. The kids have either been sleeping um, on makeshift beds um, on the ground, typically with blankets or cushions or whatever they can find. When Beds for Kids started in 2011, the program was delivering 350 beds a year. Last year was its biggest year yet, with 1,910 beds delivered. Research shows that there are about 6,000 children um, within our community who are sleeping without a bed each night. And so we know that there's still a lot of unmet need out there. The nonprofit is focused on meeting that need. As for Zykea, her new bed was delivered earlier this month. She says it's a game changer. Honestly, I like this bed better than any other bed I ever had. For Zykea and many others, it's a blessing and a good night's rest. In Darby, Madeline Wright, CBS News, Philadelphia.